Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys a little bit of a behind the scenes of my business and how I basically pack my orders, my inventory, my packaging supplies, just basically the back end of what the customers get to get after I'm done doing what I do. So anyways, um, if you do not know already, I did start my own clothing line last year. I initially, I launched on my birthday, which was October 29th. Um, I had a whole video on that. You should go watch it. It'll be linked down below. And then I restocked on Black Friday, which was November 27th. So kind of a month after my launch. But my whole inventory got stuck in customs. So I'm just getting my inventory almost a month later. So that means people placed orders and are not getting their things. So a month later, I'm telling you guys, I feel so bad. I've been trying to communicate with all the customers that it's kind of like out of my control like the delay is out of my control but i mean at the end of the day it's my fault as the owner of this business you guys know what to do like and subscribe so this right here is all my inventory i'm gonna open it just to show you guys basically what's in the inside like how it comes packed up these are my inventory shelves right here this is my packing shipping desk office station so basically this is my entire office it's low-key a mess right now i'm just moving in i will give you guys a house tour office tour everything tour once everything's done let me get back to showing you guys whatever's going on this is my cap press this is what i use to press all of my tags this is what my tags look like i get them ordered off etsy they're really cute real compact you can see them when they focus they basically just have the instructions of how to maintain quality life of your garment they're real high clay you know vibes uh So as you guys can see, these are my sweatsuits. They are compacted. I got them compacted this time because last time I didn't and it costs extremely more to ship. But I have to ship these out, so I'm gonna be working hella hard for the next two days to get these shipped out by Saturday. I want all these in USPS custody on Saturday or before Saturday. So how this process will work is, since everything's sold out, I have to press every tag on every garment that I got. This can kind of give you an estimate on what the orders look like. All of these are orders. Do you see how thick this is? This is fatter, this is almost the size of my hand. Low key of flex. I'm blessed to have had my stuff sell out, but I'm also kind of like, I'm a one man show, so that basically means that I have to do a lot of this by myself. Um, my best friend and my sisters, my family, most of the time they help me pack and stuff when it comes to pressing the tags. I like to do that myself just because I think it's more tedious work. I'm about to unpack these, I'm gonna put them on my shelves and I'll show you guys once everything's out. So this is the next day. This is the progress that I've made. Um, these are all the boxes that I've unpacked. This is my puppy, sir. Sir, sir. Yeah, he don't care. I didn't feel like doing anything last night after I unpacked them, it was quite a process. So that's them all stacked up. I, look, I love the way it looks to have just my inventory full. Like, this looks so beautiful. So what usually happens now in my process is I'm gonna print out all of my invoices, but I don't have any printer paper, so I'm about to run to Walmart really quick. My best friend is on his way to help me pack all this stuff, bless Todd, because every time I have orders and shipment, Todd is there to help me pack. So I'm about to pack all these orders, um, print off the invoices. I'm gonna probably throw those boxes out too. I don't really know because I don't really feel like it right now, but I need the space, so I'm probably gonna take those outside or take them somewhere. So when I come back for Walmart, I'll show you guys all my supplies, my stickers, my thank you cards, poly bags, frosted bags, and just the whole process. Okay, for the Walmart run, I had to do an outfit change because this is the only time I ever get to go outside, really. I have on my Champs pullover, camos and then my Yeezy 700. Okay, so I'm back from Walmart. I'm gonna show you guys basically like the inside of how the order dashboard looks from my point of view. So this is my website. I use Squarespace to make my website. I've made this entire thing myself. I'm very proud of it. You can see right here so far I've had 307 orders. That's wild. So right here it says they ordered a birch crew neck and then a birch sweatpants. For every order I print out the invoice of their order to put it inside of basically their package because I feel like that's professional. ASOS does it, so I was like, you know what, I need to do that. So I'm just gonna print all these invoices out and then I'll basically just start the packing process. Today is Friday, I'm trying to have them all out by tomorrow. So yeah, we're gonna, we, we got a lot of work to do. Okay, we got Todd finally here to help me pack. 
while the um, invoices are printing, I'm gonna show you guys basically the inside of what comes in each order. So first we have the thank you cards and with a special coupon code for each customer. Then we have custom stickers. We have the long ones with the brand name, Made Neutral. And then we have the custom stickers also. That comes with a hang tag, which basically saying thank you also, but it looks real cute and decorative. Me and Todd are about to get into packing and getting all this shit done and out of the way. Okay, so right now the time is 11 o'clock. Me and Todd have basically got, I can't even tell you how many orders we got done. Shit. So right now we basically got all of these done. That's just it. So we still have this entire racks to go, but we're gonna stop at 12 and pick it back up tomorrow. So however much we get done today, that's it, because we ain't doing no more. That's right, Todd. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> oh my goodness. But I'll check back in at 12 when we're done to, I guess, update the process, and then I'll follow back up tomorrow with the last bit. It's 12 o'clock, we just finished all of the orders. Let me show you guys how everything looks. These are all the orders we have packed up right now. It is a mess in here, it looks a mess. Um, before I start, I forgot to show you guys the poly mailers. These are what the poly mailers look like. They're just yellow with the main neutral logo and the main neutral circle around them. And these are the frosted bags that all of the orders go into. Good morning guys, it is 10.31 in the morning. Um, me and Todd, we only did, I think we did half the orders last night and we're doing the rest half today, so. Todd is on his way back. I did not sleep last night because I decided that I wanted to do a couple more just to make sure that we didn't have a big load to do today. But I kind of want to show you guys more in depth of what it looks like. Usually it would never be this busy like because since my inventory was stuck in customs, I just have to do it all at one time. But hopefully next time I have more of a leisure time and don't have to rush so much while getting these things packed and done. Look at these orders. Look at this mess right here. This is terrible, but we are getting them cleared out. Whew. After I have all of the order together, right now these orders are coming with basically a notice card, a notice letter that is letting them know about like why their package took so long and about the sizing. Each package will come with a custom sticker like this. Don't mind my nails either, they look horrible right now. They will come with this custom sticker. A thank you made neutral card. But these are how the frosted bags look basically before they go inside of the custom poly mailers. I'm done. We're done with everything. We are done with all the orders. We got everything done and completed. Todd, we have all of these packages done and we gotta send all of them out. So 